Are you ready for motherfucking Infamy 2.0? Robin Hood, Billy the Kid, Bonnie and Clyde, names and deeds that will live forever because of Infamy. You know you worked hard, you cracked the big bank with fire and fury, you slipped unseen away with the diamond, you broke Hoxton out of custody in full view of the press, and you've gained Infamy. But while dipping your toes into the first levels the Infamy is impressive, they are just that. The first. Good enough for the spot in some East Coast news network for a while, or to be posted on the FBI's Most Wanted Bulletin. For, but for true infamy, to have your name and deeds live forever, you must go further. Go beyond. Be more. And to help you achieve this, we at Overkill are fucking excited to announce that we are expanding the infamy system by 20 levels. For free. While we have your attention, please note that while the image above is hot as hell, you cannot, for example, double-wield LMGs as Dallas. That would be unrealistic. Okay, so, they came out with the new Infamy, and I, I'm Infamy 3, level 94. What are you, Nick? Infamy 3, level 14. I could be higher, but I didn't Infamy too early. Yeah, neither did I. And I have 453 hours on this game. And like a month ago, I was said I wasn't going to play it, and I didn't buy any of the new DLC. But I saw that today they added 20 new Infamy levels, and we get a 90% XP boost. And I was like, I'm getting back into this game. And I went out, and I dropped 30 bucks on all the DLCs. I got the Overkill, the like the other Overkill, and then I got the AK mods. Because I'm oh, going to nice. start playing this game all month. So I want to go through the new maps. This is the new uh, Infamy, if you can see. It used to be like the tree, but now that you start the center and you kind of branch out in a web, a very grid-like web. Yeah, gains of 10%. But then you get to the um, outer middle edges and you get to uh, different masks and a 7.5% bonus instead yeah. of 10. Yeah, so, oh. The yeah, original yeah, bonuses are still the most useful, in my yeah. opinion, but these are pretty nice. I like, um, I think I like, um, the one to the bottom left, on the left wall, um, called Android. So left, oh yeah, Android. It looks pretty cool. We'll and then it has a cool, uh, pattern, or something, yeah. or another, haze. Yeah. So, all the masks, and I'm gonna show pictures, there's Sentry, or, sorry, Heist. Sentry, and they spelled heister wrong. Heister Sentry, which it is. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the description for it is this mask was originally designed to be part of a complete head to toe heisting outfit. However, field testing revealed that the gaudy spandex suit offered no protection against bullets, knives, or grenades. The mask, however, was found to be white, lightweight, durable, and stylish. It's heist in time. <laughs> Nice. So that was the description. The other one is uh, the being, which is steampunk stuff. If you like steampunk, yeah. To the left and up, this mask is based on an experiment of the peculiar Dr. Rudolf Meshdaba, a modern Prometheus. He sought to return life to the dead with the application of industrial revolution technology. Rumor suggests that he was partially successful. The undead rose, but had an insatiable appetite for wheat, barley, and maize. Android. Ooh, I want to read this one. Which is in... Bottom leftish of the left yeah. side. You go left and then down. You want to read it? Go ahead. Yeah. Android. For the truly detached and impassive, we provide the Android mask. Lightweight alloy, chromium finish, and really cool LED lights mean this mask is ready for the bank job or the dance floor. Alas, does not make you fluent in six million languages. Damn it. I think that's supposed to be a reference to Star Wars. That's what I thought, too. Okay, so then we got Venger. Oh, it looks like Bane. Yeah, it does. Venger, it's down and to the right. Based on the crazed leader of the League of Darkness, it is unclear if that is a breathing ap apparatus or a vocabulator some yeah some speculate that was a delivery system designed to provide Ven Venger with the narcotics that gave him both his superhuman strength and psychotic rage 
So oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's leader. supposed to be Bane. Are you sure? I'm look. Oh well, yeah. Bane it wasn't is. the leader technically, but we don't want to go into spoilers. I think. I don't know. I'm sure. Uh. Yeah, that's... All right. Then we got Camul. So this one. Oh, looks... that looks like a um. It's either. Never mind. I wouldn't know. <laughs> okay. It got the what? eye of evil from um. Lord of the Rings. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Nazgul's, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. You want to read this one or me? Sure. Camul. There are things older and fouler than heisters in the dark places of the world, and one of them is Camul. We do not know if he is the lingering spirit of a long dead man or something that has crossed from the realm of shade. shade. All we know is that few look into this face and live to tell of it. <laughs> tell of it? It says live to tell... Oh, it of does it. say live to tell of it. Whoever yeah. says that, it's always live to tell the tale. <laughs> yeah, that's why I got confused. Okay, so Bella Clava is the next one, and it's like, it's um a ski mask, you know? The the old, what oh, Easter's used yeah, to wear. Yeah. It's kind of hard to see in the picture, but... The, the writing is, the weapons may change, the, ide the ide ideologies. ideologies may shift, and the accents may swap, but the Balakavav has been the main stay... Main, whatever, mainstay for the armed <laughs> robber and terrorist for decades. I like how they're kind of calling us terrorists. <laughs> Covering all but your ste steely flint-like eyes and your cruel twisted mouth. It keeps you warm when it's chilly, too. Nice. And then we got the Lurker. Looking back real quick, the yeah. being looks pretty cool, but it also looks like a sex thing. <laughs> we already have one of those. Yeah. The uh, gag ball, right? Something yeah. Like yeah. All we right. got the Lurker. The Lurker. Teeth, in, teeth are scary. Big teeth are scarier. And giant sharp fang-like teeth suddenly gnawing, gnashing? Meshing. Out where they lurk in the darkness are downright shit yourself terrifying. With all of that in mind, can you think of a better mask to keep the civilians in line? Yeah, that's pretty creepy. The last one looks awesome. The last one is Demon Shank. Which isn't a word, but whatever. It's to the down and to the left. Okay. So Demon Shank, it's a warrior spirit doesn't appear naturally. It isn't something you are born with. Like steel is forged in fire, is beaten in, t in the furnace of battle, tempered, polished, and sharpened. This mask celebrates the birth of its warrior spirit, the furnace born steel given wings. That's awesome. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. What are these? These are the materials. From left to right, there's alien slime, which comes with heister sentry and some of these seem weird because i feel like like the lurker that's an alien would come with alien swine or like uh the android would come with steampunk but we'll come to that so we got alien slime we got arizona which comes with the demon shank we got baby which comes with the lurker and that looks like brain but i think oh now i see it it's a fetus that's lovely. Oh, yep. Yeah, I, see I it. thought it was like a brain at first. We got How would eye. that on any of the masks? I don't know. We got eye, which looks like an eye, but it's weirdly colored. The eye comes with the, the ski mask. I can't say that. Hades oh, the comes Bala with Lava. Vengar. We got haze that comes with the android. We got plastic hood, very creative name, that comes with the Kamul. And we got punk, which comes with the being. Yeah. We got the new patterns also. It's digital. From left to right, it's digital. That comes with the android. Evil eye. That comes with the kamul. Now, this one's weird. It's X mach machina. Comes with the demon shank. Now, either they spelt machine wrong, because instead of the E at the end, they put an A. So either they spelt machine wrong, or they did this on purpose, because... I think I know what it's from. DSX, hold on. Hold on. DSX Deus Machina. Machina. Yeah, I looked it up. It means God from the Machine, and it's from a play. 
where a god is introduced by a crane yeah, and, and decides the final things. outcome. I've seen a couple, um... So, I've seen I at least one anime that has do yeah. sex cinema in there. I don't know if they did cinema. it on purpose because it's like... It's uh, Greek or Roman or something, or they just mi misspelled machine. No, I think they did that on purpose. Okay. There's no way they didn't. Well, they are also not. They also don't have English as their first language. True. Most of them, I would believe. Okay, so there's Hell Anchor that comes with the Lurker. I gotta find all these again. Uh, yeah, Lurker comes with Hell's Anchor. Now I thought that would be a great one to come with Demon Shank. And maybe X Machine come with the Android. I don't know why they mixed it up like that. There's Monster Visor. Which so comes then you with, have to go get each one. Yeah, there's Monster Visor that comes with the uh, Heister Sentry. Pain that comes with the Ski Mask. Balakava. Spook Balakava. that comes with the Vengar. And then Steampunk, as we said, that comes with the Being. Now, I'm really excited. Nick, we got to play this game so much. All right. With that 90 so, XP. So, seems like you guys are going to be seeing a lot of videos on Payday, too. Yeah. So, I hope you like it. And we're signing off. Bye.